Hey directors, this is how to take Mindy's list, which is last name, first name, and change it into ours, which is first name, last name. So first thing, get into your back office, click on Excel, that way it brings up your people in Excel format. I love this too though, because you got your entry date, your birthday date there, it tells you tons of other details too. Anyways, grab your name all the way down, and we're going to do Control X, just because I like to take those out and have a clean light here. Click on A. This is all your people that you know are in your team because we just took it from our report. We're going to click on Data, Text to Columns, and then make sure Delimited is marked there. Then Next, and we're going to change from Tab to Space. And you see how it kind of dropped there. See that? That's what we want. Next, just confirming everything. Finish. So we know these are our people. And here we're going to highlight it because I like to make sure everything is the same. Now, if they have a double, triple last name thingamajigger there, uh, the ones that you know are good, we're going to take. So, control, ah. So, here we're going to take Maria's out, because I know she's going to conference too. Put her in there, so now the double last name shows. This is all highlighted. I know they're good to go. Now, open up another tab. We like to keep it simple and clean. Go back over to the Facebook post from Mindy. Copy all of those names. Copy, copy, copy. Scroll, scroll. Okay. Ah. Okay. Control C will copy them. Go back into that Excel. Now we're going to do Control V to paste them. Click on A again. What we're going to do is go back up to Data. Back over to Text to Columns. It's already formatted there. It should already have it in there because we just did it. So space and next and finish. Okay, so the people that you know, like when you can see how there's a couple of them that have the extra names there. And just look through those real quick. If they're yours, take them. Like, actually, I have one down here. Oh, we gotta take this. So I'm gonna take hers, post it in there, move her name over to the correct spot. But the rest of them I'm going to delete because they're not my people. And I want to just make this as simple as possible. Now, it's still last name, first name, so click on A, right click and cut, click on C, right click and insert, cut sales, cells, when we learn how to talk. And you'll see now it's first name, last name, and if we go back over to the other sheet, first name, last name, and these are in yellow, and again, we did that because we know these are us, these are our people, so click on them, control C to copy again, we're going to paste them over here with this list from Mindy, scroll down to the bottom, scroll, scroll, there we go. And then Control V will paste them. Now, there's a couple different things you can do here. Uh, first, let's do Control A and copy them all or highlight them all. And go back up to Home and Sort A to Z. Now, it sorts them by first name and then last name. So sometimes you'll notice that they're not in order. But now you can see, like, here's a duplicate right there. Me. But to make this even simpler, do Control a again and then we are going to go to conditional formatting again for me this is in the home screen yours might be slightly different um, highlight cell rules go down to the bottom duplicate values and we can just keep the red here and you'll see it's already doing that so okay and then go through the names and see which ones now because there are a ton of people there you'll see some things like Linda but the last name doesn't match you know different things there but now you can go through and see okay this is double red here but now, like if I go down to, where's my gal that it's separated? G-H-I-J, there we go. Okay, so Tracy Jennings, it's right next to each other. I when I pulled it up a second ago, they weren't. But they might not be next to each other. It might be here, and it might be here. So check all the last names when they match. Make sure it's your people. But then it'll be able to show you whose is whose and what not. So anyways, if you guys have any questions, text me because I am not going to be my MFM the rest of the night. And I'll talk to you later. Bye.